Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Last time we got through the first temple in the game, the Forest Temple. This time we'll be finishing off the temple by beating the boss. So let's head on in. And most people who know anything about the Zelda series probably already knows what the boss is because it's a staple in bo as far as bosses can go. It even looks like a s boss room, doesn't it? Fog all over the ground. Man, it just looks like it. So, the Deku scrub outside said to stun it and then hit it. Oh god, that sound. I don't even want to do this, but I have to. Let's look up. Oh god, oh god, divide, divide, division is the sign of the devil. And this is a parasitic armored arachnid goma, a staple as far as bosses can be staples. When the, when the eye turns red, you want to hit it with a slingshot and then just go crazy with the sword. That's pretty much how the battle's going to go down. Or the fight, rather. As far as bosses go, it's pretty simple and easy. I'm pretty sure if it hits you, it only takes off half a heart, so you should be fine as far as that goes. And wait for it to turn red. And there. Shoot it while it's like that. And... Get up close, and not even close enough. I might have to go through a third time with this. Oh no, nope, got it on the second time. Nice. Oh god, it's crying. I can, I don't see why. Oh my god, epic, epic boss death. Just deteriorating into nothing. Beautiful, beautiful. And with that, we get... Where is it? Our first heart container, yay! It adds another, or our maximum life energy has increased by one heart. Your life energy will be totally filled because it totally had to. We were almost dead there. So let's go ahead and warp ourselves out of here. No need to deal with this ship anymore. And out we go. And how convenient. Well done, Link. Thou hast verily demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet more to tell you. Wouldst thou listen? We sure will. You don't look so good. Now listen carefully. A wicked man of the desert casts his dreadful curse upon me. That looks like the guy we saw in our dream. Sure does. Could he be evil? Nah. This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorceress power in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. For it is in that sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Before time began, before spirits and life existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Nehru, the goddess of wisdom. Faror, the goddess of courage. With her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nehru poured her wisdom onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Faror with her rich soul produced all life forms who would uphold the law. The 
three great goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens. And golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's providence. And the resting place of the triangles have become the sacred realm. Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred Triforce. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who ca cast the death curse upon me and sapped my power. Because of that curse, my end is nigh. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you started. Yes, I will pass away soon. But do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Link, go now to Hyrule Castle. There, thou will surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Take this stone with you, the stone that the man wanted you wanted so much that he cast the curse on me. And look at this beautiful stone. Just just look at it. I'm, I'm pretty sure they created the Nintendo 64 just so they could use this effect. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. Oh. I can't believe they changed it in the 3D version on the Nintendo DS or 3DS. You've got the Kokiri's Emerald, the spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the Great Deku Tree. One of three that we need to get. The future depends upon me, Link. Thou art courageous. Navi the fairy, help Link to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi. Good bye. And there he goes. Oh god, withering up. And that's all of the Deku Tree. He's done. Let's go to Hyrule Castle Link. Yep, I would say that's a good thing to do now. Goodbye, Great Deku Tree. So sad. Oh well. Alright, now that we're in the Kikiri... Bro, you're in my way. Hey Link, what did you do? The Great Deku Tree? Did he... Did he died? How could you do such a thing? Well, that's because, you know, I didn't do it. Yeah. What do you got to say to that? He won't believe us. He's a girthy face. Anyway, we should probably go to the castle now that he told us to. So, oh, that's a wall. That's a wall. Oh, wait, before we go, why don't we take a look into the Lost Forest, why don't we? There's just a few things we can do there, if I can remember my way through it. I'm pretty sure I know which way to go. Let's try it. I haven't done this in a while. Oh yes, and those wondering why I'm rolling so much, that is believed to be faster than no just normal walking, so. Although I'm not sure, they both seem the same to me. It's right first, yeah, okay. So this is mainly what I wanna do. Shoot this thing. Oh, not quite. Oh. Oh, there we go. Shoot it three times, and then you get a thing. That's right, you dance onto that limb. You dance there. Cool, you're great. You scored three perfect bullseyes. I have to give a neat present to such a wonderful person. Please take it. And we get our first bullet bag, or our second bullet bag, rather. Allows us to carry more bullets. We can now hold up to 40, as opposed to 30. So that's useful. Let's get back out of here now. That's pretty much all I wanted to do. Yeah, you can pretty much take any wrong path in there, and it'll take you back to the Kirikiri Forest, if it's a wrong path. And you can get on top of this house, too. It's pretty cool. But this is the way out of the forest, so let's go ahead and get out of here. And here we go. And another cutscene. A rather awesome one. Oh, where do you come from? You're leaving. Oh god, that face. I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Link, because you are different from me and my friends. 
But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please take good care of it. Oh god, I called it an ocarina. I've been watching Nintendo Capri Suns Let's Play too much. Dang it! It's an ocarina, actually. You received the fairy ocarina. This is a memento from Ser Saria. Set it to C and press C to start playing it. On the select sub item subscreen, you can set it to left, to down, right, and use that button to start playing it. You can now play different notes with something and then four something buttons to press something to quit playing or start your song over again. When you play my ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to the forest to visit. We'll be sure to. Don't worry, we will. That, I promise. So, let's go. And that's just, why does he do that? That's so awkward. Oh, that, that cutscene needed a hug. That would be a perfect time for a hug. They need a hug. I would need a hug if I was doing that. I know that. And here is what you could call the hub world of the game. Hyrule Field, and oh my goodness, is it humongous. So huge. Not as big as Twilight Princess given, but oh my god. It's just amazingly huge. So, let's go. So, up to this point, the game's been, or my commentary's been pretty informative. Ah, uh, interruption. Hoot hoot. It appears that the time has finally come for you to start your adventure. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the toughest times. Go straight this way and you will see Hyrule Castle. You will meet a princess there. Ooh. If you are lost and don't know which way to go, look at the map. The areas you have explored will be shown on the map. Press start to enter the subscreens and, and Z or R to find, find the map. On the map sunscreen, sunscreen, yes, on the sunscreen, you will find a flashing dot showing which way you should go next. Did you get all of that? And look where they put the cursor! Oh my god, no. Alright then, I'll see you around. Hoot 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 hoot! Well, uh, ah, interruption is over. Uh, I've said, yeah, you're gonna be seeing more of him. He's na his name's G Kapora Gapora, just in case you didn't know. But, uh, my commentary has been pretty informative before, but now that we're pretty much in this turning point in the game, I'll uh, keep it a little less informative. And when you're in a Hyrule field, I, I found, uh, I was shown this trick by someone, and uh, it seems pretty fast. I'm not sure if it is faster, but hey, you know, whatever gets you going. And I was going the complete wrong way. Uh, that right way right there takes you to Kakarika Village, and yes, there is actually a day and night cycle in this place. Can we get to the castle without maybe maybe we can make it I don't think we can make it I don't really usually make it oh pff, wrong button oh my god I totally just made it but the sad thing is there's something I wanted to get oh it's closing it's closing let's go there's something I wanted to get before I went in here though darn it oh and you may see I have a lot of hey doggy what's up and the doggy follows us uh, that'll be important for something later not yet though not quite yet. Listen to that. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, there's a certain dog I want to see. Where is he? I'm not sure which dog it is, though. I'll come back and check on that later. But, hey, who are you? Hey, your clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? No, I'm not. I'm from the forest. The forest of awesomeness. Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. I love how you got all that from just dots. My name is Milan. My dad owns Lon Lon Ranch. Dad went to the castle to deliver some milk and he hasn't come back yet. Hmm, I wonder why. Oh, well, let's go check. Maybe we can find him. Hopefully we can find him. That'd be nice. I'm gonna help out a little girl. And this is Hyrule Castle. Look at that look. Look at that look. That look is amazing. As you'll notice... Oh god, you again? Really? Didn't didn't we have enough of you? The princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. Hoot. <laughs> On this ground, time flows normally. But time stands still while you're in London Ranch. Or in the town. If you want the time to pass normally, you have to leave town. 
well, well. Which way are you going to go now? Hoot hoot hoot! Do you want to hear what I said again? And guess Oh, it's on yes now. That's misleading. On this ground, time flip. Wait, wait, what? Oh, he was asking if you wanted- Ah, oh, balls! I did not want to do that. So once again, apparently they put it on the wrong cursor again. For the love of God, no. Ooh, you're a smart kid. Yeah, I figured out how to go to no. Oh, God. It took me two tries to learn that, and you still said I'm smart. Well, notice these vines. If you don't get on these vines, you'll have no way of getting through this. So, let's go. I'm not sure if you have to do this in the daytime, because I never usually do it at night. Anyway, let's just jump off here. There's a certain path you're supposed to take. If you get caught by any of the guards, they'll send you back outside. So, wait. Is that a guard? He's not usually there, is he? I don't think he is. Do I have to do this during the day? Hmm. Maybe I can get past them. You're supposed to take this path right here. Oh, I can get past them. Great. So now you want to take this path through the grass that I'm taking as to not get caught. There's two guard. There's a guard right there, so be careful of him. You don't want to be caught when you're this close to it. And as you can see, there are some bricks here that we can climb, seemingly. Let's go up. And just jump right out over here. Boop. And you don't want to walk this way. Oh, it's daytime. Is it going to play the music? No, oh, I guess it doesn't play the music here. Oh well, let's go. Ride in the river. Because you don't want to get caught by those two guards standing right there. And there's also, conveniently, some rupees in here. How nice. So when you get to this, like, dirt pile here, get up on it, and hop on out. And we would be able to get in there, except there's a man blocking our block puzzle. Z, 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 mumble, mumble. Welcome, our wrench is so fun. Come and look around. Ugh, great. Uh, I don't think there's much of a point in moving those. So, uh, we can't do anything with them. So... I guess we just have to get caught. Actually, that is what you're supposed to do. I wasn't even supposed to do this yet. That's why I'm trying to mark it off. Oh, now you catch me. I had to get pretty close. Hey, you stop. You kid over there. Guess he's only supposed to catch you if you run in between the gate. Anyway, over this direction. Let's try and get out again. But Milan's here. Hey there. Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. Tee hee. Oh yeah, if you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Tee hee. And we get an egg. A weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside. Ew. Set it to see and see what happens. Aw, oh, I see what you did there. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to, yeah, that's what we get for all of our items. But, we actually need to wait for that egg to hatch. So I think I'll end off the video here. And they'll come back when uh, the egg is hatched, or is about to hatch. So, I will see you all then. Goodbye.